the Empire State Building's annual run-up presence an exhilarating challenge. Ascending 86 flights of stairs, a staggering 1-500 steps. This event, while iconic, isn't practical for many not based in New York City or those preferring a less daunting challenge. This brings us to a popular alternative, the stair climber. But how does this gym staple compare to the traditional stair climb? We consulted a fitness expert to delve into the nuances of stair climbing versus the stair climber machine, examining the pros and cons of each to help you decide which suits your fitness journey best. Unraveling the key distinctions Stair Climber vs. Traditional Stairs Our expert highlights three fundamental differences. Pace and Precision The Stair Climber with its continuously moving steps, demands a consistent pace and meticulous foot placement. This aspect not only challenges your stamina, but also hones your coordination, reducing the risk of injury through incorrect form. The Ascent vs. The Descent Traditional stair climbing incorporates both ascending and descending, offering a more varied workout. In contrast, Stair climbers focus solely on the upward climb, following the rhythm set by the machine. Impact on joints The stair climber generally provides a lower impact workout. Its softer steps or pedals are gentler on the joints compared to the often harder surfaces of real stairs. This can be a crucial consideration for those with joint concerns. Tailoring your workout to your goals when choosing between the two, the expert emphasizes that it largely depends on individual goals. While the reduced joint impact and continuous movement of stair climbers appeal to many, they also note the potential for cheating the workout by leaning on handrails, which diminishes its effectiveness. Transitioning between traditional stairs and the stair climber. Before switching from one to the other, it's essential to assess your fitness level and any existing injuries. Traditional stairs offer the flexibility to set your own pace and rest as needed, while stair climbers maintain a consistent, unyielding pace. On traditional stairs, increasing difficulty might involve skipping steps, whereas stair climbers can be programmed to match your workout intensity goals. Remember, form is paramount on the stair climber. Improper technique can lead to reduced benefits or injury. In summary, the choice between stair climbing and using a stair climber is not merely about location or convenience. It's a decision that hinges on your fitness objectives, joint health, and preferred workout style. Whether you're climbing the Empire State Building's famed steps or stepping onto a stair climber, both offer unique benefits and challenges, making them valuable additions to any fitness regimen. Till I get up, time is barely on our side